Hi, island luxury lovers. Imagine you're in the largest island of the Caribbean Sea, from high mountains to forests to jungles, grasslands, and small deserts. You're experiencing everything. An island which has ecosystems which are home to unique plants and animals found only on this island, and you are watching it and capturing these rewarding moments. We have an island like this for you. In this video, we will talk all about Cuba Islands. Cuba has a range of ecosystems, forests, caves, wetlands, and coral reefs. These places are home to all kinds of animals, including many that live nowhere else. Cuba is located where the Northern Caribbean Sea, Gulf of Mexico, and Atlantic Ocean meet. Cuba's vast natural beauty offers vibrant coral reefs, crystalline turquoise waters, lush valleys, and majestic mountains. Cuba is famous for its breathtaking beaches with turquoise water and sugary white sand. If you need to visit an island with perfect shores for chilling, relaxing, and snorkeling, and generally having a good time, Cuban beaches will not disappoint you. Did you know, island luxury lovers, in centuries past, real pirates of the Caribbean slipped into the island's coves and beaches with boats bearing illicit booty. And yes, it's true. It was one of the Caribbean's most coveted islands for pirates and corsairs who repeatedly raided the island on several occasions throughout history. Cuba is also home to rare leaping crocodiles and a host of other unusual animals, including some of the world's smallest hummingbirds, frogs, and lizards. There are caves full of bats and their wily predators, snakes, and trust. There are many, many uncountable rare species which you have never seen in your whole life. Cuba is no doubt a heaven on earth. Everyone wishes to have a little home with his family beside some glorious beauties of nature, and you have views of stunning beaches and sea escape from a balcony. You are experiencing a lively habitat of rare species and animals around you, and it is possible to buy a home, villa, or property in Cuba. The average price to buy a property, no, no, I mean a luxurious property with some bounties of nature around you, it's going to cost around $150,000, and it can go even higher depending on the location. Doesn't that make you curious to look into the possibilities? Did you know, island luxury lovers, Celia Cruz, the most popular Latin music artist of the 20th century, was born in Havana, Cuba, but spent most of her life in the United States. People often ask for the beaches before going to any island. Am I right, island luxury lovers? For some relaxation, privacy, and unforgettable views, Cuba, the largest island in the Caribbean, has 430 beaches and approximately 3,500 miles of coastline. And don't worry, in this video, we will tell you about the best and top rated beaches on Cuba Island. But before, I want you all to subscribe to our YouTube channel for upcoming videos. Playa Paraiso Playa Paraiso, or Paradise Beach, was voted the third most beautiful beach worldwide by Traveler's Choice in 2016, and rightly so. It's infamous for its clear turquoise water and bedazzling white sand coastline. Some things to do on Paradise Beach include snorkeling, swimming, and enjoying local cuisines and refreshing drinks. If you're traveling with kids, you will get to know that Paradise Beach is one of the safest beaches in Cuba for children. There are no sharp rocks or strong currents, and the water is calm and relatively shallow. Playa Veradero Playa Veradero is the most famous beach in Cuba. Varadero Beach runs across an entire peninsula, 15 miles, which is so narrow that the beach will always be a few steps from you. This beach combines green and blue clear waters, forming an exemplary boundary between the Florida Straits and the mainland. These are the reasons why Playa Veradero was picked as the second best beach in the world in 2019 and the fourth best beach in the Caribbean in 2021 by TripAdvisor's Traveler's Choice Awards. Playa Cayo Santa Maria Playa Cayo Santa Maria has no shortage of natural scenery like tropical mangrove trees and powdery sand. The waters at this beach are warm and turquoise and lap lazily amid numerous schools of darting fish. Cayo Santa Maria beaches cover a big chunk of the island's northern coastline. If you're interested in naturist walks or snorkeling, this is the perfect place. Playa Cayo Santa Maria ranked as the second best beach globally and won the top spot for the best beach in the Caribbean by TripAdvisor's Traveler's Choice Awards. 
Cuba is one of the best Caribbean diving destinations, offering beautiful coral reefs, world-class shark diving, a rich variety of marine life, and the rare opportunity to dive with saltwater crocodiles. You may experience the warm water of the Caribbean Sea with underwater marine world in Cuba, and the average price of scuba diving in Cuba is $641. The hotel scene has blossomed in the past 10 years. The drab is making way for design-led city hotels, boutique bolt holes and beach resorts with a stylish vibe and thoughtful facilities. In this part, we will tell you all about luxurious resorts and hotels in Cuba and we'll highlight the top and best rated ones. Royalton Cayo Santa Maria. The Royalton Cayo Santa Maria has gained lots of praise from once winning TripAdvisor's Traveler's Choice number one all-inclusive resort in the world and a feature on ABC News. This is an adults-only resort that's located about 72 miles from Santa Clara International Airport. The vibe here is romantic and luxurious, with attentive room service, a la carte dining and amenities. Enjoy local international cuisines in the buffet-style and a la carte dining venues, then grab a signature cocktail at one of the on-site bars. Treat yourself to a dessert at the cafe or take advantage of the 24-hour room service. You can stay at this hotel for around $275 per night, but if you have to stay here for a week, you will get a weekly package and it costs around $1,365. Head to the Hikakos Peninsula to visit the resort town of Veradero and stay at the Royalton Hikakos Resort and Spa. This is a great place to settle in for a spa vacation as there are several swimming pools, steam rooms, saunas, stylists, and treatments available at the Wellness Center. It's another adults-only resort that highlights its stretch of white sand beach and honeymoon offers. When you stay here, you'll be about 87 miles east of Havana and about 20 miles from Veradero's International Airport. The price to stay at this luxurious resort is $226 a night. Hotel Trip Habana Libre. The Hotel Trip Habana Libre is in the middle of El Vedado and close to the University of Havana, Havana and Rampa institutions, and the Malecon. This is a great place to stay to get a feel for the authentic charm of Old Havana. This is one of the largest hotels in all of Cuba with a huge lobby, 25 floors, spacious standard rooms, and the views of the Caribbean. There are quite a few meeting and convention rooms, making this a popular and convenient pick for business travelers. You can dine at the multiple on-site restaurants or visit the bars, cafeteria, or poolside grill during your stay. The price to stay here is about $140 a night. Hotel Playa Pesquero Resort. Nature lovers and eco-friendly travelers will enjoy the Hotel Playa Pesquero Resort Suite and Spa, which is located next to Bahia de Naraño National Park. This is the location where it's believed that Christopher Columbus first landed in the islands. This hotel is considered to be an eco-village and is family-friendly. Stay here and you can enjoy the multiple restaurant options including buffets with international and seafood options. Some of the popular activities to do in the area include attending traditional folklore programs and artistic performances, taking an intro scuba lesson in the pool, playing around with non-motorized water sports, and relaxing with board games. You can stay in this hotel for just $109 per night. I'm sure you guys still have a lot of questions about Cuba, but we have a solution for that, my island luxury lovers. There will be more videos about Cuba, and we will show you all the ins and outs about this amazing island group. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button, put the notifications on so you'll be the first seeing the new videos, and please, let me know in the comments what you liked most about Cuba Island, and which island would you like to see next? Follow us on Instagram at IslandLuxuryYT for daily luxury islands posts and for a few seconds of distraction at your work or whenever you need a little break. That was it for today, Island Luxury lovers. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.